G'day my fellow mud over loggers, uh, Van and Ev on uh, Samoki, the Suzuki Bandit on this uh, Saturday afternoon. Um, I'm on my way to Two Wells. Uh, I've heard the bakery there is very, very good, so I was going to get a couple of uh, couple of pies if um, if they've got any left, of course. It's a long weekend. Um, I don't mind this little ride out. I've done it many times and quite enjoy it. So yeah, the um, the storm. If you follow my channel, you would have seen the storm the other day um, that rushed through um, my area and uh, it hit the bike shop, um, which made the. Uh, uh, the ceiling falls fall in um, because there's so much rain the gutters couldn't ha uh, couldn't handle it and it overflowed and uh, wet all the uh, the ceiling um, and all that collapsed with all the uh, insulation and uh, stuff like that and it went all over the uh, well it went all over the front counter where 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 he serves and what a mess water everywhere and it flooded the office it flooded the toilet it flooded uh, a little um, storage room that we keep uh, little uh, like batteries and um, tubes and and you know little little items like that so yeah it was a bit of a mess folks a real mess um, luckily, uh, it uh, should all be covered by um, uh, property insurance, which uh, he doesn't pay for because um, it's not his property. So the owner, who lives, well not lives, but works right next door at the, uh, the wreckers, um, <laughs> he has to do all the claiming and all that sort of thing. So yeah, um, pretty much recovered from that. Um, just the repairs have to be done. And uh, all should be back to normal. I did um, have... Uh, I did have... Um, Another thing to tell you, um, the uh, the Hornet, the uh, Honda Hornet 900, has sold. Um, the chap that I talked to, not that it was me who sold it to him. I mean, the bike prep basically sold itself. So um, he he did come back and buy it. He actually bought it last Sunday because because it was Andrew's motorbike um, he did, and he's got keys to the shop he just went up there opened the shop and uh, sold him the bike because like I said it's Andrew's bike so he uh, didn't have to do it within business hours so that's gone um, probably another land development just here most likely. Yeah, so uh, he's happy about that. He's still got uh, another one to sell. Uh, it's a white, um, uh, a white CF Moto touring type bike. So um, I'm sure that'll go in the not too distant future because the uh, well hopefully the weather is brightening up a little bit and uh, we've had a fair bit of rain and uh, cold weather recently so maybe uh, we'll get a bit better weather tomorrow's raining so I thought I'd come out today and uh, do a vlog as well as uh, check this uh, bakery out 
It shuts at half past two, it's quarter past one now. Roughly quarter past one. So fingers crossed it's still open. And if they have any uh, any pies, I'll, uh, I'll get a couple. And if they're any good, I'll be back. So um, I'll keep riding and uh, as usual, if uh, if I think of anything else to uh, put into the vlog, I will uh, I will do so, and I'll do my uh, farewell a little bit later near the end of the ride. Yeah, um, I want to talk about video editors. As you know, I uh, have to change my video editor because. Um, Corel Video Studio is doing something to the sound so I'm trying my hardest to learn um, Cyberlink Power Director Is it easy to get around? Well, it's reasonable um, I've had a look at a few tutorials to help me out a little bit but when you watch them they uh, they tend to do it very very fast and you sort of uh, if you blink you miss what exactly what they're doing but um, some of the uh, things you can do in there is is, uh, is is very very um, how can I put it intense I suppose uh, you've got to do this, this, this and this to get that, that sort of thing, so... But I'm getting there. Um, I think it's one that uh, I might stick to more than anything else. Um, until, well... Until... <laughs> until something happens with that that uh, <laughs> it might do something to the sound or whatever but I don't think it will this is um, the road from uh, Two Worlds to Gawler um, I've travelled this a fair few times and uh, it's not a bad little ride out Uh, I'm going to go through Gawler and then uh, up in the hills and uh, go and see my friend and uh, watch a bit of um, Foxtel Sport, whatever might be on. Who knows what will be on? No idea. So when I get, again, when I get near my uh, end of the ride out, I'll, uh, I'll take my uh, farewell. Yeah, um, before I go, there is a question for my UK, um, UK um, followers, uh, watchers. Um, been noticing in the uh, in the news over here that there's a, a, a petrol shortage due to not enough drivers to drive the trucks to the service station and there's been fights and all that sort of thing. Has it affected you um, in any way? And uh, could this be because of Brexit? I only hear what we're, I hear on the, uh, on the news over here, so I w I'd like to know your opinions, my UK uh, friends. So, uh, yeah. I don't want to bore you with this road, you've seen it many times, so uh, this is uh, Bandit Nev on uh, Samoki, the Suzuki Bandit, bidding you all very, very, very safe riding, and uh, until next time, cheers for now.